Uh, yo, what's going on guys? Uh, I haven't seen really many videos of anyone using the Primo Cache to boost their read and write speeds on their uh, hard drives. Like, uh, for instance, my G drive right here is my main gaming drive. That's where I put all my Steam games. Like, as you can see there, like Tom Clancy, I use that all the time. It's very hard drive demanding as for loading into the games and stuff like that so I'm going to show you how to boost that I'm going to let this run in the background and boost the reading writing read and write speed using Primo Cache here so I'm going to show you how to do that first you want to open up your start menu go to type in part to open the create and format hard drive partitions I'm going to let that go in the background. Once that comes up, go to your SSD. Uh, hard drive right here. It has to be an SSD for it to work properly. You want to go to shrink volume. Before it do its thing. Okay, and the enter amount space to shrink, you're going to enter 65535, that gets you exactly 64 gigs, you're going to shrink that. It's going to create an unallocated 64 gigabyte partition, you're going to go to create, part create the partition, create new, new sample partition. You're going to use all of it. You're going to choose whatever letter you want. Don't really matter. You're going to go to. Just don't change anything. Just click next. Finish. It'll format. Open up for me. So you got. Got that created. So now you're going to come over to your Primo cache. Manage level 2 storage. Create level 2 storage. You want to use the uh, 64 gigs. Hit format. Yes. Okay. Now you created level two uh, storage right there. You got to create new cache. You want to select the drives you want to select, like mine. I want to select the G drive for all my game files I have saved on there. I have a second drive, so I'm going to select it, but select how many of your drives you got that you want to boost. As you see, there's my read and write speed right there. Pretty, pretty bad. Alright, so now you want to hit next after you select the drives you're wanting to boost, which is my, my main one is G. You want to go to read and write. Hit next. You're going to lead, pretty much lead that where it is. Invisible RAM. You want to hit create. I've already done it. You're going to hit create. You're going to put 17404. You're going to hit continue. And it'll create it. Create invisible manor, memory manager. Don't really change nothing there, but you want to go here. Hit max. You want to hit start. Now it's booting now it's uh now it's selected. So you wanna turn this speed that I j was doing whenever I recorded this at the start. And I'm gonna hit it again. You wanna turn those scores, reading write speeds, you wanna turn them into uh this now. See? Okay went from whatever it was to that now that I'm using the Primo Cache right here now this is only 60 day trial you will have to purchase this afterwards you know but I mean in the long run it's to me worth it Uh, that's pretty much all you do. You take a uh,
part of your SSD. Shrink it to 64 gigs. Uh, create the, the, the second level storage right there with that 64 gigs. And then you create a new uh, cache task. And you're going to use these two drives or whichever drives you got that you're wanting to boost. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. I hope this helps you. It helped me out a lot. Um, peace.